Steve Schill directs the film Obsessed, and you'll be obsessed with looking at your watch during the time you watch this film. It's a fatal attraction type drama about a man who is very popular and executive in the corporate world who is suddenly finding himself being stalked by a temporary worker who works for him as a secretary there. Ali Lata plays the stalker and the stalkee is Idris Elba. He plays Derek Charles, a senior executive vice president at a company and he's up on the move and he's got a really beautiful attractive wife named Beyonce who plays Sharon who also happened to work or she used to work at the same company as a secretary for Mr. Charles. Guess what happens of course? Well, of course what happens is there's a lot of suspense at least towards the end of the film but before that it's an absolutely ludicrous hodgepodge of screenplay, poor lines and poor editing. Definitely a film that you can skip, although Ali Lata gets to really throw herself at Idris Elba. Definitely some strange things going on in this film, not because of the fact that uh, Idris Elba is being stalked by Ali Lata. That's not the issue. It's just that Beyonce spends much of her time off screen in this film, and she's the only thing and the only thing that's good about Obsessed. She is the best reason to see it at all. The film's not nearly as bad as a lot of critics have been saying that it is. It's hardly the worst film of the year, but it's definitely far from anywhere near close to the middle of the road of this film either. Again, poor screenplay and also the best assets not on screen at all for very much time, and that's Beyonce Knowles. She has proven, if nothing else for this film, how to act and how to stay engaged and how to keep an audience rooting for you. Beyonce has built a steady resume of effective performances. She did very well in Cadillac Records last year, 2008 that is, and she doesn't do a bad job here either. Beyonce's got a great future ahead of her, obsessed as a film doesn't. I'm Omar Moore for PopcornReal.com.